Numbers 26, verse 1. The second census of Israel. And it came to pass, after the plague, that the Lord spoke to Moses and Eleazar, the son of Aaron the priest, saying, Take a census of all the congregation of the children of Israel, from twenty years old and above, by their fathers' houses, all who are able to go to war in Israel. So Moses and Eleazar the priest spoke with them in the plains of Moab, by the Jordan, across from Jericho, saying, Take a census of the people, from twenty years old and above, just as the Lord commanded, and the, and the children of Israel who came out of the land of Egypt. Reuben was the firstborn of Israel. The children of Reuben were of Hanak, the family of the Hanakites, of Palu, the family of the Paluites, of Hezron, the family of the Hezronites, of Carmi, the family of the Carmites. These are the families of the Reubenites. Those who were numbered of them were 43,740. The son of Palu was Eliab. The sons of Eliab were, were Numuel, Dathan, and Abiram. These are the Dathan and Abiram representatives of the congregation who contended against Moses and Aaron in the company of Korah. When they contended against the Lord, and the earth opened its mouth and swallowed them up together. With Korah, when that company died, and the fire devoured 250 men, and they became a sign. Nevertheless, the children of Orah, Korah did not die. The sons of Simeon, according to their families, were of Nemuel, the family of the Nemuelites, of Jamin, the family of the Jaminites, of Jachin, the family of the Jachinites, of Zerah, the family of the Zerites, of Shaul, the family of the Shaulites. These are the families of the Simeonites, 22,200. The sons of Gad, according to their families, were of Zephon, the family of the Zephonites, of Haggai, the family of the Haggites, of Shunai, the family of the Shunites. Of Ozni, the family of the Ozanites, of Eri, the family of the Erites, of Arad, the family of the Eridites, of Areli, the family of the Relites. These are the families of the sons of Gad, according to those who were numbered of them, 40,500. The sons of Judah were Er and Onan. Er and Onan died in the land of Canaan. And the sons of Judah, according to their families, were of Shelah, the family of the Shelanites, of Perez, the family of the Parzites. Of Zerah, the family of the Zarites. The sons of Perez were of Hezron, the family of the Hezronites. Of Hamul, the family of the Hamulites. These are the families of Judah, according to those who were numbered of them, 76,500. Sons of Issachar, according to their families, were of Tola, the family of the Tolites. Pua, the family of the Punites. Of Jashub, the family of the Jashubites. Of Shimron, the family of the Shimronites. These are the families of Issachar, according to those who were numbered of them, 64,300. Sons of Zebulun, according to their families, were of Sirid, the family of the Sardites, Elon, the family of the Elonites, Jalil, the family of the Jalilites. These are the families of the Zebulonites, according to those who were numbered of them, 60,500. Sons of Joseph, according to their families, by Manasseh and Ephraim, were... The sons of Manasseh, of Machir, the family of the Machirites. And Machir begot Gilead, of Gilead, the family of the Gileadites. These are the sons of Gilead. Of Jezer, the family of the Jezerites. Of Helek, the family of the Helekites. Of Asriel, the family of the Asrielites. Of Shechem, the family of the Shechemites. Of Shemida, the family of the Shemidites. Of Hefer, the family of the Heferites. Now Zelipho, Zelipho had, the son of Hefer, had no sons. The daughters, but daughters, and the names of the daughters of Zelipohad were Mala, Noah, Hogla, Milka, and Terza. These are the families of Manasseh, and those who were numbered of them were 52,700. These are the sons of Ephraim, according to their families, of Shutthila, family of the Shuthalahites, of Becker, the family of the Bakrites, of Dahan, the family of the Tahanites, and these are the sons of Shuthela. Iran, the family of the Iranites. These are the families of the sons of Ephraim, according to those who were numbered of them. 32,500. These are the sons of Joseph, according to their families. The sons of Benjamin, according to their families, were of Bela, the family of the Belaites. Of Ashbel, the family of the Ashbelites. Of Hiram, the family of the Hiramites. 
Shufam, the family of the Shufamites, of Hufam, the family of the Hufamites. And the sons of Bela were Ard and Naaman, of Ard, the family of the Ardites, of Naaman, the family of the Naamites. These are the sons of Benjamin, according to their families. And those who were numbered of them were 45,600. These are the sons of Dan, according to their families, of Shuham, the family of the Shuhamites. These are the families of Dan, according to the families of all the families of the Shuhamites, according to those who were numbered of them, were 64,400. The sons of Asher, according to their families, were of Jimna, the family of the Jimites. Jesuai, the family of Jesuites, of Beria, the family of the Beriites. The sons of Beria, of Heber, the family of the Heberites. Malkiel, the family of the Malkielites. And the name of the daughter of Asher was Sarah. These are the families of the sons of Asher, according to those who were numbered of them. 53,400. The sons of Naphtali, according to their families, were of Jazeel, the family of the Jazeelites. Of Guni, the family of the Gunites. Of Jezer, the family of the Jezerites. Of Shalem, the family of the Shalemites. These are the families of Naphtali, according to their families, and those who were numbered of them were 45,400. These, these are those who were numbered of the children of Israel, 601,730. Then the Lord spoke to Moses, saying, to, those, to these the land shall be divided as an inheritance, according to the number of names. To a large tribe you shall give a larger inheritance, and to a small tribe you shall give a smaller inheritance. Each shall be given its inheritance, according to those who were numbered of them. But the land shall be divided by lot. They shall inherit according to the names of the tribes of the fathers. According to the lot, their inheritance shall be divided between the larger and the smaller. And these are those who were numbered of the Levites, according to their families. Gershon, the family of the Gershonites. Of Kohath, the family of the Kohathites. Of Merari, the family of the Merarites. These are the families of the Levites family of the Libnites, the family of the Hebronites, the family of the Malites, the family of the Mushites, and the family of the Korathites. Kohath begot Amram. The name of Amram's wife was Jochebed, the daughter of Levi, who was born to Levi in Egypt. And to Amram she bore Aaron and Moses, and their sister Miriam. To Aaron were born Nadab and Abihu, Eleazar and Ithamar. And Nadab and Abihu died when they offered profane fire before the Lord. Now those who were numbered of them were 23,000, every male from a month old and above, for they were not numbered among the other children of Israel, because there was no inheritance given to them among the children of Israel. These are those who were numbered by Moses and Eleazar, the priest, who numbered the children of Israel in the plains of Moab by the Jordan, across from Jericho. But among these, there was not a man of those who were numbered by Moses and Aaron, the priest, when they numbered the children of Israel in the wilderness of Sinai. For the Lord had said of them, They shall surely die in the wilderness. So there was not left a man of them except Caleb, son of Jephunneh, and Joshua, the son of Nun.